This week on Arts, the Guadalupe Dance Company premiered its first performance in celebration of Mexico's Independence Day in September of 1991. We visit the Guadalupe Cultural Arts Center as they celebrate 25 years of this exceptional dance company. Something just magical seems to happen when the music is on and you're performing. Arts is presented by the Tobin Center for the Performing Arts. Thursday at 8 on KLRN. PBS presents the 2016 Hispanic Heritage Awards, celebrating the achievements of Latino leaders, scholars, and entertainers. This year's honorees include Justice Sonia Sotomayor, Juno Diaz, the Fania All-Stars, Angelica Maria, and many more. Hosted by cast members from Orange is the New Black, come join the celebration at the 29th Hispanic Heritage Awards. Friday, September 30th at 10, 9 central, only on PBS. The initial movie, Giant, was shot in Marfa, Texas. This incredible story of this dynasty that was written by Edna Ferber that George Stevens then adapted into a movie. She really made a lot of Texans mad with that book, Giant, because nobody had really understood the discrimination and the segregation and what was happening to Mexican-Americans. Well, I play Juana. I play a Mexican girl. I was the daughter-in-law of this very prominent family in Texas, and I was a Mexican, and they didn't like Mexicans. They talk about all these problematic things that were happening at that time in Texas. The problem of Mexicans and Americans in that town. The only reason why we had to bury here because they put the fence up there and separated us. It was segregated, and it was segregated at that time. It was segregated in all aspects of society, including public accommodations, restaurants, hotels, neighborhoods. And that's the way it was until Giant came to town. Nobody had, had ever really told the true story. In today's generation, I'm hoping that, that young people or people today will see what was happening at that time that was, little, that was hidden from a lot of the rest of Americans, and he captured it. He captured it perfectly.